Say what's happening, man? It's your boy Shout L of Man. You watching notes from the underground TV. We right here in the building. Let's get 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 it. I just dropped my new mixtape on the man part four. Hosted by DJ Scream. Very large mixtape, man. You know, got a lot of bangers on there. Yeah. Um I just I got a song on there. The first single is called Hold Up with my artist stunt man and Fable. You know, we haven't done a song probably in the last five years, so you know, it was a great collaboration. Basically, you know, when I first met 50, it was years ago, you know what I'm saying, but I was with for a solemn and one at the time, you know what I'm saying, 50 a great person, but you know, I just didn't know him like that, but I was always a, 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 a big fan, because you know, I know his struggle. His struggle reminded me of my struggle, you know, because it was so hard coming up for me. You know, my mama was on drugs, my dad was elsewhere. My grandmother raised me. She died from cancer when I was 17. And you know, I've been arrested 28 times. I've been convicted four times in my life. You know, I got 11 kids. I got uh, nine girls, two boys, 10 baby mamas, you know. I feel like I could be anywhere, man. But I'm right here, you know, it feels good to be here. And um, when I first took over 50, when I, when I came out my situation with a solemn, um, I had like six deals on the table. Uh, was six, uh, yeah, six opportunities on the table when I went to New York, and 50 was the last person that got added add to the list. And I had three meetings, 50 was the fourth meeting, and I didn't have to take a nap, no other meetings after 50. You know, we had like a seven hour meeting, great meeting, and I was convinced G Unit was where I wanted to be at. Uh, it's not a goal on oxygen, okay. you know what I'm saying, but you know. Like, what I like to tell people about this, this show, I did not reach out to nobody for no show. You know, it was brought to me on two separate occasions, and I turned it down twice. But people were telling me, like, you know, oh, here, like, look, you know, you got a unique situation, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, you're a father that's in your kid's life, you know what I'm saying? You do this and do that, and you take care of your kid. There's a lot of fathers gonna take care of one, and I say, you're right. And so, you know, that's what made me go on the side to do it. And second of all, the only reason I feel like the show got cut because of what they named the show. Yeah. All my baby's mamas. You know, I didn't want to name that show that, you know what I'm saying? That's what they named it. So, you know, that's why I probably got all the backlash it got. I was gonna name the show, you know, I got eleven kids and I got ten baby mamas. So that added up to twenty one. So I wanted to name the show being twenty one. Mm -hmm. See, but you know. Basically, you know, if it, if it happened, it happened, but you know, I'm thinking about doing it myself and shopping to the network, you know what I'm saying? You know, just stay tuned, you know, it might happen, man. Say what's happening, man, it's your boy, Shout L of Maine. We're watching notes from the underground TV. We're right here in the building. Let's get, get, get it. Skinny Man.